Okay, so if you have uh, an MP3 or some sort of an audio file that you want to use for this, that's great. But a lot of times you don't have those. So here we're in the OneNote page, and you can see that I've actually got a link under the course handouts here at the beginning that says audio from YouTube. And if you go onto YouTube and you find something that you think is appropriate uh, and you want to get the, just the audio from it, so let's say it's a music video of Taylor Swift, oh, I'm so sorry, um, and you want to add that to your soundtrack, uh, to your video, that you can go ahead and do that. Uh, because we're doing this for educational purposes, that's actually perfectly legal. But there is another one, and that's this one here where it says, use this link to get free sounds and effects from YouTube. And if you actually have a, a Google... Um, account, you can go ahead and do that. If you don't, uh, then you'll have to either sign up for one or you can uh, come and see me and we can uh, figure something out for you. Okay, so it has, uh, YouTube has a whole pile of different songs here and you can go through all of them and everything else, but I'm going to choose this beach disco music and and it and it's kind of bizarre. You'll actually come over here and you're going to go download. Now, we're going to download that and when it downloads, yeah, that's good, isn't it? So uh, we're going to actually go ahead and find that uh, download and figure out how we're going to get that into our movie. So what I did here is I went into my f um, your name under the Carnelli, and remember we created that download uh, folder earlier, and there's my Beach Disco. So I actually have to copy this. So we're going to click on it once, and we're going to go copy, and then I'm going to go back up, and we have to go into our photo montage. And we'll go in here, and we're going to go under Assets, and we're going to go Audio, because that's what this is. Open it up, and then Control-V to paste it in. Okay, so we've actually got it into that folder now, and we're good to go, right? So let's go back into Premiere Pro. There is Premiere Pro. Let's import that audio because we have to actually bring it in so we know how to work it. So we're going to double-click here, and we'll go up to the audio one now, and we'll just grab it, and we'll say Open, and then we'll drag it in, and we'll put it under Audio. Now, I'm going to put it down on Audio 3. If these aren't turned on, all you have to do is click on Audio 3, the little... Uh, area where it says A3 and go ahead and click on it in there. Now it's way way too long isn't it? I mean look at how long it is. That's ridiculously long. So I'm going to make this thing quite small and I'm just going to drag this corner. You can see how I'm doing it and eventually it'll just match up right to the end there. Do you see that? It kind of snaps in place. Okay so sorry I'm going to play this and you can hear this. There's my soundtrack. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and save that. And then I want you to go out and render this movie and put it in your finished video folder for this project. Give it to me on an SD stick and we're ready to go. If you're not sure how to render it, go back and watch that movie from the first uh, project sample. Okay, there you go. You've done your first major project. Congratulations.